Hey everyone, it's Eric, and today I have a Bath & Body Works candle review for you. We need to talk about this Bergabot and Birch, you guys, out of that new collection they just released, uh, what, last week or so. There's a total of five candles in the collection, and to be perfectly honest with you guys, I wasn't super thrilled about this bergamot and birch when I first heard it was going to be in the collection. I was like, mm, okay. Bergamot for me isn't something that uh, really wows me as a fragrance. I'm kind of like, yeah, I could take it or leave it. It seems that we put it in a lot of our candles. So I'm always kind of like, yeah, whatever. It was okay. <laughs> But after smelling the store, which it smells really nice, and comparing it to the other candles in the collection, I'm actually starting to feel like this could be one of the better candles in the group, at least on cold so far. So yesterday we did talk about the uh, Vanilla Musk, and <laughs> make sure I have the right candle here, the Vanilla Musk in my uh, coffee and a candle vlog. So we did talk about that yesterday. It's very light, you guys. So light candle. And then uh, we also had Palo Santo and Sage in this collection, which I was very excited for. Smells really good, and we do need to review this. I have some thoughts on this one that we need to talk about. And then, of course, another one that I was actually really excited for was this Yuzu and White Pineapple. The best part of a pineapple is slices that are the sweetest, tenderest, juiciest. Uh, I thought this would be really nice. I love yuzu citrus. I love pineapple. But the star fruit in this kind of kind of throws me off on it. So still have to review this as well. Hopefully it smells good. So those are three of the other candles in this group. And then there was also that rose and lychee candle that uh, I did pass on. But so many of you have commented that it smells really good. So I might go back and uh, take your advice on that one, you guys, and uh, purchase that candle. So, you know, next time I'm in the store, I'm going to give it another sniff. But today we are going to talk about this bergamot and birch. So the uh, fragrance notes on this are your vibrant bergamot, black amber, and birch wood. like this. I like the birch mixed in with this. I think that's what makes it uh, stand out to me with that bergamot. It smells very fresh, springy, uh, not fresh like the laundry scents. I don't want to, you know, use it like that, that word fresh like that. It's not fresh like the laundry scents, but fresh spring uh, candle. It smells like something you would use if you were doing like a home spa day. That's the kind of vibe I get off of this candle. Really smells good, you guys, with that birch. I did pull out one of my other candles that has birch in it just to kind of compare. So I did pull out a vanilla birch. This is, you know, a Christmas candle here, uh, or at least in a Christmas um, jar style. But uh, this candle, the vanilla birch, has a lot of vanilla with the birch, which I love. So it's completely different than this bergamot birch that has such a fresh fragrance to it. I really, really like this. <laughs> I think out of the group, this might be my favorite scent out of this group, which surprised me because I really wasn't uh, all that interested in this, but after smelling it, I'm like, yeah, I am on board with this. So I'm really hoping that this has a nice throw, you guys. I, I don't want to be disappointed with this candle because it smells so good on cold to me. So let's light this candle and see what happens. Okay, you guys, I am back. I think we have a winner here with this Bergmont Birch. Yes, it has such a nice throw to it. I would give it a solid medium to strong throw on this candle, you guys. It's filled out the family room. It's gone into the dining room. It's traveled into the kitchen. So it has some range to this candle. So I'm very happy with the throw. The fragrance isn't overpowering either. So it's just the right amount. Lovely fragrance, you guys. I get mostly like a spring kind of green leafy fragrance to this. You get the birch, the bergamot mixed in there. I can smell them in this candle. 
but it does have like a spring kind of herbal leafiness to it. If you like those herbal kind of candles, this is really nice. I still think it'd be great for like a home spa day, you guys. Oh, I just had the best bamboo massage. Oh, they kept whacking me with it until I confessed to stealing that bread when I was seven. <laughs> oh, what a load off. That It's got that kind of a vibe to it uh, overall. It's a lovely fragrance, not super heavy, but fills out the room wonderfully, you guys. So excellent, excellent throw performance on this candle, which makes me very happy because, you know, that, of course, is what we pay for when we buy these scented candles. We want to be able to smell them in the room, and this one does not disappoint on that. So super happy about this candle, really enjoying it. And I think this would be great for like if you were having like a cup of herbal tea or something. I don't know. It just seems like it should be that kind of a candle, you guys. <laughs> so really enjoying it. If you do have this candle, please leave comments down below and tell me what you think of it and how it's performing for you in your home. And as always, please hit that subscribe button and I'll see you later. Bye-bye.